Hi, in this video we're going to have a look at how to ensure that during the logon process, when you get to that logon screen, it doesn't display the last user's name. Now this is actually a security issue because if someone walks into the office and sees the logon screen with the last user's name, they've at least got halfway there. They've got a username that they can use to try and break into the system. Okay, so for example, if Mr. Bubbles, okay, he's logged out, and then basically when he log, logged out, it'll show on the screen, basically Mr. Bubbles, okay, and then it'll give a chance for you to enter a password in there. Okay, you don't want to see that Mr. Bubbles. So how do we do that? We go to local security policy, that's secpol.msc, S-E-C-P-O-L dot M-S-C, okay, click on that, it brings up this window. Then we basically want to go to local policies, okay, and then it's security options. Okay, once that is loaded, we go all the way down to their interactive logon. Do not display last username. Make sure that's clicked as enabled. Click OK. And then if we were to sign out, okay. Now, as you see, it doesn't say Mr. Bubbles over there, or it doesn't say any other username. So basically, it's a lot safer this way. So now, if someone's trying to break into the system, they need to work out a username themselves, and they also have to work out a password rather than getting halfway there. Hope this helps. Thank you for watching.